Hundreds of people gathering in the streets of Cripple Creek today to honor the life of Patrick Weir. He's the man who lost his life here at the Molly Kathleen Gold Mine. I'm Jake Walker in Cripple Creek, Colorado, where we talked with the mayor who says she wants to thank the community for their support during this difficult time. You can see lots of hugs and tears along Bennett Avenue here in downtown Cripple Creek. People are honoring the life of Patrick Weir. On the exact cause of his death, it's still under investigation, and Ozla says it could be up to six months to complete that investigation. People we talked to describe him as a strong, silent, and cool character. He's survived by his brother, John, and his seven-year-old son, Anthony. We talked with a member of the American Legion. First thing I thought of was for us as a uh, the American Legion post up here to be able to uh, to honor Patrick and to be here. Uh, we all support our city, which means we support our citizens also. Also new as of this morning, we got an email from the family and they say they are deeply grateful for the kindness they've been seeing and they do ask for privacy though, as they grieve and make arrangements. And you can see this note right here says, you will be missed along with many other notes and flowers, heartfelt messages for the family out here at the gold mine. We'll stay in contact with OSHA though and let you know what we find out about those moments leading up to his death. For now in Cripple Creek, I'm Jake Walker, News 5.